In this video, I will show you how to extend background using Generative Fill in Photoshop Beta. Forget Content-Aware Fill, the new AI version is mind-blowing. Here's how you use to extend a photo in any direction. You can use any image you like to expand the background on, but a few tips to get started. Try and pick an image where the background isn't too complicated and feels like it could naturally be expanded. Images with lots of complex shapes or people might confuse the AI and give worse results. Adobe's AI is impressive but not perfect yet. I am going to start with this very simple image. First, you will want to start by expanding the background by using the crop tool. Simply drag the crop box outwards until you have enough of a border area to fill. Next, you want to select the new crop area. To do this, use your selection tool. The rectangular selection tool might work best here. Select the image leaving a few pixels inside the border of the original image. The newly cropped area is selected. Now the new generative AI toolbar that hovers below your image. You will then want to click the button on this new toolbar below that says Generative Fill. It will then give you the option to describe what you want using text prompts, enter the right thing in this box, and Adobe's AI control to work out the best way to expand the background. Then just hit Generate. After a short while of processing, depending on your computing power this might take a little while, Photoshop will fill in the edges of your image with new information. Subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to get the latest updates. As you can see in the image, Photoshop did an incredible job. It managed to add the missing section of the tire in the foreground, as well as adding a realistic looking sky and landscape in the top left corner. AI tools are here and are meant to be experimented with, so go and try this for yourself, but also break the rules and see what happens. You might be surprised. You are only limited by your own imagination. If the video is helpful, hit the like and consider to subscribe. If you are already subscribed, thank you. For more help join our group. If you have any further questions leave them in the comments and thanks for watching.